First COVID-19 vaccine deliveries in our area include thousands of doses for Philadelphia. Trang Do joins us from the UPS hub in Delaware County to explain where they will go and how they will get there. Good evening, Trang. Hey, good evening, Yuki. The delivery of those first doses to the city's health department and hospitals came as a bit of a surprise because they were not expecting those shipments until tomorrow. However, it is just the first in several of these special UPS cargo flights that it are expected to land at PHL this week. Deliveries of nearly 3 million doses of Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine began around 8.30 this morning after touching down at more than 30 cities across the country Sunday and Monday, including Philadelphia. Some doses arrived this morning. We have confirmation that some doses will be coming tomorrow and then the remainder will be arriving on Wednesday. Amber Termal is Philadelphia's immunization program manager. She says the city will receive 13,650 doses this week to be split among the department and all of the hospital systems. Termal expects vaccination of frontline healthcare workers to begin Wednesday. Each individual hospital and healthcare system are making their own determinations about who within their organizations they want to prioritize. PHL Airport spokeswoman Florence Brown says crews are ready to ensure that the UPS planes carrying this precious cargo can safely land and take off, even if Wednesday brings heavy snow. In the event that that occurs, the airport's responsibility will be to help uh, prioritize those aircraft, de-ice them quickly, and get them back on in the air as quickly as possible. The vaccine shipments packed in special boxes that will maintain the ultra-cold temperature they need for several days are as anticipated and closely monitored as Santa Claus's flight on Christmas Eve. It's been a difficult planning process, but it feels really thrilling to have doses that are almost about to be in people's arms and that we can sort of begin to get back to what we've all sort of lost. Now, Termal says it is difficult to predict just how long this first phase of vaccinations for healthcare workers will take before the vaccine is more readily available to other groups. However, she says that the FDA approval of the Moderna vaccine, if that happens very soon, then the timeline could definitely be sped up. But for now, we're live from the UPS Air Hub in Tinicum Township. I'm Trang Doe, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Jess. All right, Trang, thank you.